morning guys welcome back so i am about to get ready to head out and do a day in the life for you guys it's been a minute since i've done a little day in the life video so i figured i'd do one today it is october 1st a tuesday so we're gonna see what we can do today now yesterday i think i made about 111 dollars I worked, I think, six hours and 45 minutes, which wasn't too bad. During the lunch hour, I did get taken down into Bethesda in DC, which helped a lot with the trips. I was making more money per delivery yesterday, so that was really good. But yeah, I'm gonna see you guys in the car. All right, guys, so I'm in the car now, and I decided to just go online. I don't usually do that from my house i usually just drive to my area and then go online but figured can't hurt to go online from home and see what happens so i guess i'm just gonna start driving and hopefully i get something but i'm gonna drive to my usual area and let's see what we can do today i wanted to like make a video to show you guys like if it's picked up or not so we'll see if it's picked up usually mondays are really good anyways and tuesdays aren't really the best so since i already told you guys how much i made yesterday it should be a good comparison to see how much I make today so let's go okay y'all so I've been online for about 45 minutes now and I still have not gotten an order I'm in my usual location um so yeah so I think I'm just gonna move from this spot and see if I can get an order so let's go so I just pulled up here to a little bit further up and look what we got an order so i'm currently like right here by taco bell taco bell is like right there i'm right by bassett furniture um just parked right next to the loading dock but just got an order so it's been about 50 to 55 minutes that i've been online guys and i'm just now getting my first order so i've got an order at tight kitchen let's pick up this food all right you guys just picked up that order it literally took like one minute when i went in there it's going two minutes away like two minutes yeah let me go drop this food off y'all and then i will check in with y'all in a second all right guys so i have dropped off that order it was a office building and i already got my second order we are headed to honeyfish poke it's just like on the other side of that shopping center so let's go all right so i'm about to pick up this order but i wanted to show you guys that i made four dollars and two cents for that first order so y'all let me know down below in the comments if y'all think that's worth it for the short orders so there was a little accident when i was dropping that honeyfish poke order off and now i'm going to quickway japan it came in right before i dropped off that um honeyfish poke order so i am literally right here all right so i picked up the order and they had it ready so that was good but it is going 20 minutes away, 8.5 miles. It's going to Olney. Longest order of the day. I usually don't go out and deliver in Olney because it's not very busy the times that I've been up there. And so it's kind of out of the way and like in its own little area away from stuff. And there's a few restaurants there, but not enough for me to be like going out of my way. I just dropped that order off and I made like $10 in... 26 cents or something like that and then only i don't think i'm gonna stay up here because like i said it just it's very slow up here i haven't gotten another order yet so i'm gonna drive down to silver spring or into rockville i don't know hopefully once i start driving down there i'll get an order all right guys so i'm all the way back in rockville having got no orders and i just got one um, from gyro land so i am gonna go pick this up child so i picked up the order from gyro land is it was a short order quick i think less than three miles away i'm here at the location waiting for the person to come out there's no suite numbers or anything usually when i get to a location and it says deliver to door and there's no suite number like it is right now i'll wait a couple minutes i'll text them that i've arrived and then sometimes they'll text me and give me a suite number or sometimes they'll say they're coming out or whatever real real slow today i think this might be her though is this is her S 
so yeah so she came and got her order so far today how much have we made $26.95 so far for trips and somebody tipped me a dollar and 79 cents all the orders that I've been picking up have been like small orders just like it's lunchtime so of course but dinner time I like when I get big orders because that means the potential potential to get more tips because there are some big orders and stuff them people don't be tipping one time i picked up a bunch of food from popeyes like multiple 24 pieces of chicken it was over a hundred dollars worth of chicken and they didn't tip me at all it just depends i guess how people are feeling if they want to tip or not they're already spending a lot of money on the food you would think that they would tip but it's not always a guarantee you guys even if they order a lot of food you still might not get no tips so don't even count on it all right guys so i'm home now just got home for my lunch break basically so i'm gonna show you guys how much i made so far and that is $29.95 $4.79 of so that was tip and i only made four trips in three hours and 17 minutes so Compared to yesterday at this time, I was at $46 already. So, yeah, that's not all that great, but it is what it is. What can I do? Um, it's currently almost 2 o'clock, so I'll see you guys around 5 o'clock when I go back out. Alright guys, so I came out. I went online at about 5 o'clock. It's 5.07 now, and I just picked up my first order from Jersey Mike's. And I'm headed 3.3 miles away to go drop it off. And so I just picked up another order from Kim Kim Thai. And I dropped it off already. So now I'm currently sitting in the parking lot. It is currently 5.50. So let's see how long it takes to get the next order. And so seven minutes later and I've got another order. I'm going to Urban Barbecue. And they ordered one thing. They pulled pork plate so let's go pick it up all right guys so i just picked up from bamboo green bamboo over here rockville um still in rockville but i did drop off the previous order from urban barbecue it wasn't that far away so just keep getting these little quick orders today don't know what's going on but Hopefully as the night goes on, I get some longer orders. So I'll see you guys after I drop this off. I'm not going far, 2.5 miles. So, okay guys, so I just dropped off the green bamboo stuff. Not just dropped off, but I've been sitting over here, same spot where I was earlier. So I'm gonna move from here because, I don't know, maybe this is I not a good spot video. anymore. I lost. Listen to the podcast. And I'm just gonna move, so I'll let you guys know whenever I get another order. You guys, seriously, as soon as I moved from that spot, I literally got an order. Why does that happen all the time? Let me know. Does that happen to y'all? Because you'll be sitting in a spot for like 30 minutes, nothing happens. As soon as you move, you get an order. That's crazy. But I'm headed to Jinya Ramen right now. But yeah, I'm gonna go pick up this food. They only ordered one vegetable ramen i am headed to um bethesda right now perfect timing because it's 7 30 and it's a little slow over here so that's kind of good that i get sent to bethesda hopefully it's better down there and hopefully the tips are better this lady says she tipped me in the app i don't see no tip from her yet so we'll see about that i hate when the when the customers tell you that they tipped you because it's like a lot of times they be lying like why y'all be lying to people like i've had several people lie to me and say that they freaking tip me and then they end up not tipping me so it's like what's the point like nobody's telling you to tell somebody that you're tipping them just keep your mouth shut and take the food <laughs> i'm retarded let me get off i'm gonna see y'all later though all right y'all so i just freaking dropped off Jinya ramen and then i picked up another order i picked up another order from the big greek cafe and i dropped that off and now i'm here at smoothie king 
in Bethesda, still in Bethesda. So they ordered a smoothie, so I'm gonna pick that up. Guys, I just picked up that smoothie and it's going all the way to Hyattsville, 7.2 miles, but it's gonna take me 26 minutes. Let's go drop this off. What's up, y'all? When I dropped off that smoothie, I was in Hyattsville and I ended up just driving to the Wheaton area. It is currently 9-11. So, so far today, I have made $86.74 for you guys. So, I've been online for almost eight hours, as you guys can see. It's a bit slower than it was yesterday, but tips have been pretty low today so far. Pretty, pretty low. You guys can see, like, only, like, five people tipped. Alright y'all, so I was sitting there for a good second and nothing came in, so I am driving down here to um, Kensington to see if maybe five guys might have some order tonight. I might wait 10-15 minutes and then I'm gonna just head home if I don't get anything because I've been waiting for a while. Alright guys, so I was here for probably about five minutes. Now I got an order, so it's at five guys. And they ordered a cheeseburger and a grilled cheese. So I'm literally right there. I'm just about to pull over there and go in. They didn't order any fries, so I've got to wait for fries to be cooked. And I think I'm gonna make this my last order for the night. So I will see you guys back at the house and give you guys the final day's earnings. Here we have it, the final day's earnings. So $97.78, 12 trips, 8 hours and 34 minutes. You guys could see today it was pretty slow. The tips were very low as well. Now I wouldn't say that things have picked up just yet, especially without the promotions and the quests going on. But you guys let me know if it's picked up again in your area down below in the comments. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!